Howdy everyone, it's me once again, the one and only Rodan. Now today, I figured I would review one of those old western type movies today for you folks. This is the one I'm going to be reviewing today folks. This is going to be a rather short movie review folks because the film is, itself is about 42 minutes in length so it's pretty damn short. As I said folks before, it's still a... Uh, Stuff I have to review on my to-do list. There's plenty of stuff to go on from here. It feels like it's never gonna end. Oh boy. It's gonna be one of those movies for my 200 movie collection I have out here, folks, of these cowboy collection. So yeah. I feel I'll just uh, start uh, something to review, something from here, so. So, of course, as always, let's get into the plot, shall we? Yeah. Well, anyway, the plot basically sounds, centers around this one character named Tex and his sidekick, uh, whom are delighted to join the musical traveling show. However, when the cowboy, these cowboys, whom is in his group, comes in without pain, Tex steps in from the stage and pulls out his sex gun and holds the audience up. Up until the manager points out that the other six men do not pay their fee, something will happen of course. So of course the main characters in this particular film must do what's right and of course must take care of the villains even though they may be pretty much disrupting the peace so to speak. So of course the town must kept be kept safe from the danger, and of course, the good cowboy characters want to make sure that the entire place over here is is done right, and and law and order is kept done here. So basically, this is your traditional cowboy movie. This was a cheaply made film, folks. So altogether, this was a pretty okay cowboy movie, folks. It's not the best one I've seen, and. Overall, it's a pretty solid movie. Would I recommend it? I would only really recommend this film if you're really one of those hardcore and cowboy fans. If you're really into the old vintage um, western movies. I've seen western movies that are far worse than this. But and it's not the best cowboy movie out there, folks. It's, pre it's pretty okay, I suppose. And... I mean, the the pacing is pretty slow, and the acting itself is pretty okay. And that does have pretty low, I mean, really low production values overall. They made better cowboy movies out there, folks. So this isn't really the best example of cowboy movies out there, folks. But yeah, there's some singing cowboys in this, folks. And I'm, I was never really a huge fan of singing cowboys, this kind of a thing, really. But... Yeah, this was entertaining in its own little way, I suppose. And, again, I would only really recommend this if you're really into this kind of a thing, really. So, those better cowboys films out there, those better western films out there, is this the worst thing ever made? No, I'm not gonna, I'm not, I'm not gonna say it's the worst thing ever, folks. And, because I've seen far worse than this. So, I kind of felt that this had more potential than it should have been, really. So, overall, I'll say I recommend it. If you got nothing else to do, really, I guess you could watch it. Because, again, keep in mind, like I said before, this movie is really short. It's only, like, roughly, it's, it's just roughly 52 minutes, really. So, yeah, it's not that long, really. If you got nothing else to do, really, and you're just bored already, I guess, I, get, I guess you can see. You could watch this if you want. So, overall, this was a pretty solid cowboy movie. This is a pretty solid western film. I like some of the editing really. Considering that the production values aren't really all that high to begin with I suppose. So and the thing itself is pretty okay I suppose. And I, I kind of wish that this could have been maybe a bit longer anyway. Because if it was a little longer maybe it could have been a bit better. Maybe it's a little too short for its own good I guess. But anyway, nonetheless I didn't hate the movie folks. So, yeah, it wasn't all that bad, really, folks. So, again, I recommend it, because why not, I suppose. 
So at the end, end of the day, folks, this one wasn't too bad, I suppose. It's quite enjoyable. So it'll get an overall rating of a 5.8 out of 10. It gets a 5.8 out of 10 for me. So, like I said, it's a pretty solid film. So yeah. And of course, as always, thanks for watching and take care. See ya. Oh.